asked why this president hadn't got off to a quicker start. It's not the way he works. He doesn't okay. react, he doesn't uh, make a move. He's th thoughtful, considerate, brilliant, <laughs> beautiful, <laughs> glorious man. Not to be maudlin, but do you know where your resting place will be? You bet, and I'd be glad to show it to you. Where is it? It's at College Station. It's the at prettiest the, place the you ever saw. Mm -hmm. Yeah, our daughter's already buried there. The um, one that died. How old was she? Almost four. It's about 50 some years ago. Yeah. And you'll she's be, there, a little stone. You'll be buried together there. Yeah. Right mm -hmm. at the. What's it like, Barbara, to be the mother of a president? Well, it's, it's, um, it's worrisome because you worry about the responsibilities. Having said that, it's not very much different from the other children. We were in Washington last week and I got there before George and Laurel was overseas and it really touched me. The president came out and met me at the door. And I would feel the same way if Doro stopped work or Marvin stopped work and came out of the building. I really loved it. It was, but it's not that much different, yeah. do you think? Except Does he the call huge home? Yeah. lots. Calls mom. But to see how, oh, calls mom and dad to see how we're feeling. Is it cold Maybe. up there? Or uh, tells us what he's going to do. We ask, what you going to do today? Or yeah. was it hard going to? Checks in early in the morning. <laughs> I'm passionate about every child needs to learn to read and write and understand. This is ridiculous. <laughs> All these pretty girls here in pretty dresses and you're doing me. I wonder if I'm so old, I'm the only one in the room who really knew Audrey Hepburn. Because I did. And what a beautiful woman she was. And what she did for children was amazing. Thank you very, very much. It was a great honor for me to be here. And now, because I am 90, I'm going to go home. <laughs> so remember, this, the campaign has just started. And I want them to know that Jeb is the finest man, almost, I know. He's very much same values of service that his father has, and his brothers, and his sister, and maybe his old lady. That's you? Me. <laughs> you're, I'm, you're not my old lady. You, you dodged me on Donald Trump. Do you want to? No. You want to go full New Jersey on Donald no. Trump? No. <laughs> I do not. I don't even think about him. I'm sick of him. That's, that's very strong.